Manja, manja, bon appetit, let's eat. It's time for Tank's Cooks. Manja, manja, bon appetit, let's eat. It's time for Tank's Cooks. It's time, it's time, it's time once again for Tank's Cooks. Old Tank had a major farm. E I E I O. Yes, that's right. Pigs, chickens, cows, none of them are safe from the barnyard prefix sandwich. Yes, that's right, the barnyard prefix sandwich. Now, I got sent two recipes. One from Bobby Arthur, tell me to make pork roll, or, uh, Taylor ham, he says pork roll, but it's Taylor ham, Bobby, it's Taylor ham. And this other one, uh, making a what he calls a Kev McMuffin. Both of them have English muffins. Both of them have eggs. Both of them have cheese. But one has Taylor ham, one has bacon. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna combine them and I'm gonna rename it Tank's Barnyard Breakfast Sandwich. And we're gonna start off by air frying up some bacon. Air fry the bacon, air fry the bacon. Fry it up real nice. Air fry the bacon, air fry the bacon. It's gonna be really nice. Yes, that's right. We're gonna air fry some bacon. Uh, we're not gonna make a whole lot of bacon. We're gonna make like uh, four little slabs. We're gonna put it into the air fryer. Air fryer, the air fryer. And we're gonna cook 12 minutes at 425. Let's go. And we'll get this bacon cooked as we start our Tank's Barnyard Breakfast Sandwich. All right, let's get the bacon out of here. Put it on a nice little paper towel to um, soak up some grease. And now we're gonna put in the Taylor ham. Yes, that's right, the Taylor ham. Uh, some people probably call it pork roll, but it's really Taylor ham. Invented by some guy named John Taylor. Yes, that's right, John Taylor, a New Jersey specialty. John Taylor's original Taylor ham. That's right. It's a spicy ham. Very spicy, got a little bit of a spice to it. It's a specialty in New Jersey. So we're gonna also gonna air fry the Taylor ham. This is a nice thick sliced Taylor ham, see, look at that. Boom, boom. Little two little slices. I don't want to fry up the paper, the plastic it came in. So we'll put the two little slices of uh, Taylor ham in here. And six minutes, and we'll see how it looks. In the meantime, we'll get ready to put our English muffin into the toaster. English muffin into the toaster. The English muffin into the toaster. Boy, that bacon looks great. great. Look at that. Look how crispy this bacon came out. Could this bacon be any more crispy? Perfect. Perfection. All right, we'll put a uh, little, our English muffin into the toaster. Bum, bum. We'll lightly toast it. English muffins just popped and like I said lightly toasted. Guess we're gonna do more to it. We're gonna butter it up. Butter it up. Butter it up. Butter up. We'll butter up the English muffins. Bum bum. <clears throat> Let that butter seek into those nooks and crannies. Nooks and crannies for the barnyard prefix. The barnyard prefix sandwich. Get down all those nooks and crannies. Get the butter into those nooks and crannies. <laughs> Don't tell your granny. The butter's going into the nooks and crannies. Taylor ham is almost done. So now it's time to pair our egg. We're gonna do that in the air fryer as well. Let's use our uh, little uh, little uh, cooking spray onto our Muffin tin, muffin tin, and take uh, 
our easy egg cracker. Easy egg cracker, 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 easy egg cracker. There we go. Perfect crack this time. No shell. It worked well. All right, the Taylor, the pit, the Taylor ham is almost done. Let's see how it came out. There it is, the Taylor ham. And you know how you know when Taylor ham is done? When you take it out, it, oops, shit. Didn't want that much grease, look at that grease. You have to turn it almost into Pac-Man to flatten it out. But there it is, there's your Taylor ham. Really good, kind of a little sloppy there. All right, we're gonna put this back in the pan for another in a few minutes. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna cook our egg. Cook the egg in here. Cook the egg in here. And we're gonna cook it for five minutes at 350. All right, these, um, his egg has about another two minutes to cook. So let's get some cheese. Put the cheese on the English muffin. And let's stick the, uh, melt the cheese with the egg. And we'll also put the Taylor ham back in too. Or, there we go, Taylor ham back in, back in, back in for the last two minutes. Here we go. Barnyard's coming together. The barnyard is coming together. All right. The countdown is on. Five, four, three, two, one, done. All right, let's see. We got a nice little melted cheese for the bottom. There it is. We got our egg looking quite steady. Let's flip the egg out and put it onto our sandwich. Here it is, there it is, there it is. Slipping on, slipping on, slipping on, slipping on. Don't want to burn our little hands. We don't want to burn our hands! All right. Now we'll put the bacon on top. Bacon on top, bacon on top. Put the bacon on top and get our little last piece here. We could maybe put this bacon to the side because the bacon is overflowing. Get our last piece here. Put it on top. And there is Tank's Barnyard Breakfast Sandwich. Tank's Barnyard Breakfast Sandwich. Time to plate the meal. Time to plate. Let's see how this baby came out. If I could get my mouth wrapped around this baby. Look at that, look at that. Ooh, hoo hoo. How am I gonna chew on this? This is a mouthful. I might have dislodged my jaw. Kind of like those Trollatio sandwiches. All right. Mmm. Came out, came out terrific. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Bone appetite, manja manja, let's eat. Mm -mm -mm. Do you like Kevin Friedman? We like Bobby Offer. Send me a recipe. NJ Tank nineteen. Uh, NJ Tank ninety nine at gmail.com. You never know when I might be inspired by your recipes to create a masterpiece like the Barnyard Breakfast Sandwich. This came out really good, really good. So, thanks again and manja manja. Bon appetit. Let's eat.